Hello Buddy Fighters, welcome back to another Buddy Fight video. Today we're looking at Buddy Fight X Booster Set 3 Overturn Thunder Empire. Now, the September Core Core issue had a ton of leaks, and as you see right there, we've got a new flag and some other powerful cards. So, first off, let's go over some quick information that we already know. Total card types right there in front of you, worlds included, Dragon, Danger, Katana, Darkest Dragon World. You're going to get support for Thunder Empire, Chaos, Oni Assassins, and a new Danger World deck concept, which is for the dual golems. And the set will introduce a new ability called Overturn, which is once per game ability. They're used by bots and other popular monsters. So, um, again, looking from the September Core Core issue, there were some cards like Dual Golem Monsters and Items that are not Chaos, but they were too blurry in the issue to make out, so they couldn't find out the effects and stuff, so they did not post it on Buddy Spoiler. And you're also looking at new forms of Gear God, Cerberus, and Team and Godo. Apparently, Team and Godo is supposed to be a Thunder Empire. And again, if you guys want to check any of this stuff out for yourself, Buddy Spoiler, link description below. Anyways, let's have a look at this brand new flag, Dragon Fang Thunder Empire. Card type flag. You only use Thunder Empire cards, so that's basically any card, monster, spell, even dual cards, um, impacts, anything that has Thunder Empire in its attribute. Your initial hand becomes 7, so you get one more hand card than in the usual. Your initial gauge becomes 1, so you are losing one gauge there, but there are some Thunder Empire spells, for example, Distinguished Replenisher, if I said that right. Which gives you 3 gauge, 1 life, it's re really really nice, that basically brings you up to 4 gauge if you use that first turn. And your initial life becomes 11. So, already you're starting off with the extra life, extra hand, so, and definitely with Thunder Empire's draw power, you should not have a problem if you know what you're doing, getting gauge. So, really a strong flag right there, you see bots right there. So I'm hoping, again, I'm not going to say anything because it's not confirmed, um, any relation between these cards and the anime, but we're probably going to be seeing this in the anime sometime, so... Um, yeah, I forgot to say spoilers. Moving on, really incredible flag. We've got the bots right here. Thunder Empire Dragon, his original name, which was, I believe, Arl Bots Drag Royale, the first, um, if you saw episode one of Buddy Fight X. Thunder Empire Dragon, Arl Bots. Drag World, Sai Su Monster, Thunder Empire Dragon. The art looks incredible. I looked at these cards on their separate page. They are secrets. He's got, like, a shield and some kind of Thunder Lance, or I, I can't exactly tell, maybe some kind of, like, um, spear. So he's Thunder Empire Dragon, size 2 monster, so you can still have your size 1 globs, penta, fanning, it's a uh, power plus, sorry, power 13k, 13,000, critical 2, defense of 6,000, call cost 2 gauge, so it is one more gauge than normal bots, it's got the signature bots ability, during your turn this card in the field cannot be destroyed, and if you have 4 life or less this card gets critical plus 1, so you already got 3 crit, double attack, 13k power, 6k defense, pretty solid, and also that's 6k defense, um, was it dragons hiding I, f I forgot what this spell was it's a dragon world magic world dual spell um returns or destroys a card in pulse field of 5000 uh defense or less that was shutting down a lot of uh bots attacks and stuff like that because bots can't be destroyed but he can be returned to hand so this basically prevents him having these incredible high stats prevents him from being affected by a lot of spells and abilities so overturn here is the new ability it's once per game but this is um so basically the overturn ability is different depending on the monster but this battle bots, oh my goodness. Overturn during your attack phase, hey one gate, just discard a card from your hand. Stand all cards on your field. That's your items, your monsters, everything. You can only activate overturn once per game, and it cannot be nullified, cannot be respond to. So it's basically a new game-changing ability Bushiroad is activating. So not activating, um, putting into Buddy Fight, which to me seems like a really big potential and it definitely can make the game a lot more fun. Again, the power cap for stuff is going to be raised, so that seems like a big thing, but I tried out Overturn. It is pretty darn strong because um, E Hero Matt made an unofficial update with these cards for the ones that their effects and abilities were confirmed. My goodness, this bot is absolutely insane, especially with that double tack. So, again, really, really just strong bots right there. I'm still hoping for Jibby Panda. Might not happen. We've got Overturn Ninja to Suki Kaki right there. So, he's getting a Ninja Thunder Empire form. So, basically with the new flag, um, they didn't have to do separate worlds, so it's like Parade of 100 Demons and Chaos, where it's with an attribute. So, Thunder Empire attribute, you can use this card with that uh, flag, even though it's, because, you know, it's not a Dragon World flag, it's only for that attribute. Anyways, Call of Cosplay 1 gauge, it's got overturn, but um, as you see right there on the image, it's black and all smudged out, so you can't see the ability, so they didn't know that. But that right there is Penetry, that's got 5,000 power, interesting stats, so... It's cool to see, this is actually also a triple rare by the way, um, to see other monsters getting, uh, you know, Thunder Empire forms and overturn abilities as well, especially for Katana World, which is pretty awesome. 
We've got Drunken Demon God Kitty Buki right here. Katana World Sassy Monster on Assassin Chaos. 10,000 power, critical 3, 5,000 defense, call cost, pay 2 gauge. At the start of your turn, destroy all monsters on your opponent's field. If you do, deal damage to your opponent equal to the number of cards that were destroyed. So, overturn reversal. Um, I don't know why it, the name is different. Um, it's basically the exact same thing if you do read the effect. But anyways, when a monster in your field is destroyed, pay 1 gauge. Choose a monster in your field, and for this turn, that card cannot be destroyed. You can only activate overturn reversal once per game, and overturn reversal cannot be nullified, cannot be responded to with move and ambush. So before I go to talk about this card, Bushy Road could change some effects and stuff, but this is basically what we've got from the Core Core League for now. Definitely an interesting card. Um, I don't really play Chaos or Oni Assassins too much, but definitely having that strong ability. It is at the start of your turn, not any turn, so you do have to keep that in mind. And a monstering field has to be destroyed to activate overturn first, so I'm assuming you would use this more with Oni Assassins, not really Chaos. Unless, I guess, you really wanted to maybe, maybe Chaos Strain or something. I'm not too sure. But I think Chaos Strain is when you leave the field. But it's an interesting card, definitely. Um, overturn for Oni Assassins. 10k power. I don't know. It's a decent card. Moving on, we've got Size 3 Black Dragon Abigail. Sorry, Black Death Dragon Abigail. Which is a Black Dragon, a White Dragon, and it's for Thunder Empire. So that's interesting right there. Um, we've got a Size 3 Monster, Darkness Dragon World. 7,000 power, 7,000 defense, critical 3. Call cost, pay 2 gauge, all cards in field cannot be destroyed by card effects, nor returned to hand by your opponent's card effects. Then, all cards in their soul cannot be put into your drop zone by your opponent's card effects. So basically, this just protects your entire field, basically. Um, stuff on your field can't be touched, and overturn, um, it's still not confirmed, but I feel like this Abigail's pretty decent. I mean, honestly, it wouldn't really work well with uh, Black Dragons or Thunder Empire, but the fact you can... Um, basically protect your entire field is really nice and then also overturn as well I don't know why but because of the ability of this card I was thinking that this cards overturn would go somewhere along like for this turn protect all your cards from destruction or something like that I don't know it seems like overturn is gonna be pretty gosh darn game-changing if that wasn't already obvious but yeah on to some interesting Abigail right there Tell me what you think, because I don't play Black Dragons too much, but I heard from a really good Black Dragon uh, player that he's not really too great. Anyways, last card, Magic Stone Golem Dragrim. So here is the Chaos Golem card. Um, I believe the name of the character was Bruto, one of the three Chaos people under Wisdom in the anime. So, Danger World, Size 2 Monster, Dual Golem, Chaos, 7,000 power, Critical 3, 5,000 even. Call cost, pay 1 gauge. All Dual Golem on your field get Critical plus 1. So from that ability off the bat, you can already assume that dual golems are just going to be really hard hitters. I mean, Danger World is already known for that high critical, um, just absolutely destroying your opponent really quickly, rushing a lot of aggro. So overturn reverse right here. During your main phase, pay one gauge. Um, and then it says here, during your main phase, pay one gauge. I believe that's a typo. Um, if you do for this turn, all cards on your field get critical plus two. Again, once per turn, can't be nullified, cannot be stunned to with penetrating move. So this card... In chaos, it is for your all cards in your field get critical plus two for this turn. So do keep that in mind. Um, definitely a really strong card. Um, size two, you can't use it in chaos, but there are a lot of stuff for chaos. You need to have a size three or greater. So I feel like the only reason it has that chaos stamp is to be you know because the per, the buddy of this character, uh, sorry, buddy of this monster is under wisdom. But I guess maybe uh, you could use this in Chaos and, you know, give crits deck, but obviously it wouldn't work as well in a Chaos deck. But it is a really interesting card. Um, again, we'd have to wait until the other scans and maybe some more leaks for the rest of the Dual Golem cards. And also, I believe it was Hunter Search who pointed this out, that um, they didn't want to make it a Dual Dragon just because, it, um, you know, Ayn and other stuff could use it Dragon Swy. But definitely, guys, I'd love to hear what you guys have to say about these new cards absolutely excited for it um matt did make an unofficial update for this so again still waiting for more stuff to come but definitely it does get me excited to see these kind of new cards and concepts definitely waiting for more stuff because definitely tyrants uh because you know new forms of cerberus so that's probably going to be interesting unless for some reason they make an armor knight cerberus new forms of gear god um yeah just prepare yourself for that and Demon Godel as well, being a Thunder Empire card. Because Demon Godel is known for Soul Guard, Counter Attack, Destroying Items, so that'll be really interesting to see as well. So, already, with these two cards, Thunder Empire is looking strong. Definitely going to wait to see what else will come from this set. 
And I'd love to hear what you guys have to say about this. Do you think these cards are too broken? Uh, do you think that they should be... Um, maybe, what do you think about Overturn? Do you think it's too strong of effect? Do you think that it's really unique that different characters and monsters are going to be getting this once return game-changing effect? Which, you know, if they were to do it properly for every single world could be a thing. But obviously, the most stuff in this set is going to be meta. I mean, Thunder Empire is already meta, so, yeah. Anyways, that's going to be about it for me. Have a great day, and that's going to be about it. See you later.